Hello everybody, Quarantine Fantano here, Idiot's Business Music Nerd, with another album review. What's their name again? And you see, this is where the album falls flat at. Uh, um, this track, I, I took notes here. Um, yes, yes, this track was terrible, that's what I wrote here. It was just garbage. The, the whole track has this gaping, just, oh, it was just terrible. It's just, I wouldn't listen to it again. That's what I would say. I'm feeling a light four to a strong six. It wasn't that good. And the, it has this bashing uh, uh, drum beats that just, it made me feel like I had a brain tumor at some point. The lead guitarist, I forget his name, um, uh, yes, Robert Jr., Robert Jr., um, you see, Robert Jr., um, you see, Robert, Robert Jr., um, Robert, Robert Jr. is the lead guitarist on this track, and I can't help but feel that his, um, guitar was just, Terrible. It was just terrible. It was just fuck. It's just getting hot. He's the the guitarist for this band that they call they call themselves a band. He he's a he um, no. I was not feeling that guitar. I was not feeling that. I you know uh, the the first thirty seconds of the track intrigued me, but then when the guitar kicked in, I realized this was a steaming pile of uh uh cow manure. Um. I hope that this individual never makes music again because it was very bad. Yeah, I just wasn't feeling it on this record. I wasn't feeling it. Um, synth pop sound is just not for me, okay? I, I do not care for it. I do not like it. Um, Def Grips on the other end. <laughs> great band. I, I analyze the lyrics and I, I really take the lyrics to heart. In this song, he uh, he sings about um, love and how hard it can be. And that, that's just beautiful. Um, that's just, well that's just beautiful. <laughs> As beautifully stated on the album itself, it's um, a strong ten. Um, I, I just, I was listening to it while I was jotting down notes about it, and, um, you know, I was just working on some stuff at home, and, uh, I just, you know, it really encapsulated me. I, I had never heard music that was good before. It was, uh, it was actually a surprise. It was a surprise, you know? Um, uh, let's review the new Childish Gambino album now. Uh, you know, and track one was just terrible, okay? Now we're on to track two, the title. Okay, that's it, guys. Goodbye. I don't know how... Oh, God, I don't know how he fucking does this shit. How does he wear a bald cap every day? I just don't get it. I do not get it. I don't know how anybody could do that. That's just crazy. I like my glasses, though. It's nice. <laughs> yeah. I love how everything is so so much more dramatic when you just like Wendy Houston's The Power of Love is simply one of the most powerful songs I've ever heard in my entire life. And that is a fact. Anybody watch American Psycho?